What is up guys, welcome back to the channel, this is Dr. Hamstang and today we'll be doing a speed ramp temperature kick bench in a 3D mark test here between two very bold phones. In the first corner over here we have the Xiaomi Mi 11 and inside here it does come with the Snapdragon 888 and inside here it also does come with 8 gigs of RAM and 256 gigs of storage. In the other corner over here we have the OnePlus Nord 2 and this is the phone that is with the MediaTek Dimensity 1200 and inside here it does come with 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of storage. So the first thing that we are going to do is of course check out the phones over here and the temperatures and in the room we're in it's at about 26 degrees the phones over here 33.3 here 34.1 so what we are going to do at the start of this is of course to boot up these two phones and we're going to see which one would start up faster normally Xiaomi phones do have a very fast boot up let's see over here if we can beat the OnePlus Nord 2 both of these two phones have been charged up to 100% to make this a fair comparison of course here you do have 4500 4500 milliamps of battery Okay, looks like, let's see if the Mi 11... Alright, surprisingly, the OnePlus Nord 2 does beat the Mi 11. So, first time over here that the Mi 11 has lost to another phone from another manufacturing company. Okay, in terms of the calendar, both of them are ready to go. So, let's check out the temperatures over here, 34.9, here 34.4. So, okay, pretty similar on both of these two phones. Also, do note in terms of the display over here, both of them are maxed out in terms of the brightness. And also, when it comes to the refresh rate, both of them are running in at 120 hertz. Both of them are connected to the same Wi-Fi network and also location is on. Every other form of connection is disabled on both of these two phones. Also, do note that both of these two phones, all apps have been closed to make this a fair comparison before we start this speed test. So these are the apps that we are going to test out. So one, two, three, let's go. All right. Pretty neck and neck. But over here, the Mi 11 ahead of the OnePlus Nord 2. Alright, let's go on to the next one here, Pokemon Go. Looks like the Mi 11. Alright, Mi 11 done with the Nord 2 just slightly behind it. Alright, let's go on to YouTube. Okay, pretty similar. Maybe they're not too. Let's go on to Instagram. Okay, pretty similar, I would say. Let's go to PUBG Mobile. Very huge app over here. Let's see which one would come out on top. Okay, looks like the Mi 11. Okay, so we're done here with the Mi 11 with the Nord 2 just slightly behind it over here. Okay, all nicely all set up to go. Let's check out the other apps over here. Let's check out Chrome. Okay, Mi 11. Let's check out those temperatures. 36.1, 36.1, so very, very similar. Let's go on to Facebook. Okay, pretty similar, I would say. Let's go on to Shopee. Okay, again, pretty similar. Let's go on to YouTube Music. Okay, slightly faster on the Nord 2. Let's go on to Settings. Okay, similar. Let's go on to Manchester United. Viva Ronaldo. Let's see if it's as fast as the Ronaldo signing. Pretty similar. Let's go on to the Premier League. Okay, I think they meet 11. Let's go to Netflix, again Mi 11, camera app, okay I think pretty similar, okay next up TikTok, okay looks like the Nord 2 in terms of Twitter, okay Mi 11 and also let's go on to the Play Store. So, okay, pretty similar on both phones. Let's check out those temperatures. Okay, 36 degrees. And then let's check out the Mi 11. 
all right also about 36 degrees so very very similar in terms of performance speed and also temperature let's check out the ram management over here let's go to Genshin impact okay both of them having a refresh there which is disappointing let's go to pokemon go both as well refresh there again let's go to youtube okay me 11 just held up pretty well over here let's go on to pubg mobile this one is pretty impressive both of them holding up this huge app over here really nice let's go on to twitter okay both doing all right let's go on to manchester united here on the me 11 better compared to the nord 2 and also let's go on to play store all right both of them pretty much similar but of course here i think it does have a better ram management let's check out those temperatures over here 36.4 36.3 point three. so very very similar indeed so let's move on to the next test all right so next up here we are doing a gpu test and i'm using InShot for this so both of them are going to export this at 4k at 30 fps and let's see which one comes out on top over here, both of them do have a very good GPU and CPU, but it seems like over here, the MediaTek Diamond City seems to have a very good GPU when it comes to this kind of video editing apps. Even the X3 GT was performing really, really well. As we can see here, very, very fast compared to the Mi 11. Very, very good. Yes, way ahead of the Mi 11. Impressive here from the OnePlus Nord 2 all right so okay so funny done over here so that is it with the gpu test all right so right now i'm going to do a geekbench test and before i do that let's check out the temperatures over here 36.2 very nice temperature and over here 36.3 so pretty similar in terms of the temperatures on both of these two phones let's open up geekbench here in terms of battery here is at 98 percent whereas on the mi 11 it's at 97 percent so let's run this test one two three let's go so i'll see you guys at the end when we do get the results Okay, so we are done here with the Mi 11 and surprisingly, it didn't hit the 1000 mark but it does have a very good score, 984 and a multi-core score of 3059, 259. So let's check out the temperatures over here, 38 degrees, let's check out the back over here, 36.6. So let's just give some time for the OnePlus Nord 2 to finish up over here and let's see what scores are we going to get on this phone here. So it's going to be finished right now yes so 800 still a very good score but the multi-core score fairly behind compared to the mi 11 as we look at the history over here's the first time so 984 but as you can see on the nord 2 it does give me very consistent scores over here temperature wise 36.5 on the front 37 degrees so yes pretty good scores from both phones all right guys, so now we're gonna do a 3D mark test over here. And let's check out the temperatures. On the back, it is about 36.3. Here it is about 36.3 as well. Let's check out the 3D mark over here. So both of them are gonna run the wall test and let's see who would come out on top. Okay, so we are done here with the Mi 11. Let's check out the temperatures over here. As you can see, different scores over here. Back temperature, 36.5. And let's check out the Nord 2, 36.4. So yes, quite a significant difference when it comes to the temperature. Let's check out the front over here, 38 degrees. Here, 36.C. But as you can see here, the scores are very massively different compared to each other. Next up, we're going to do a slingshot test over here. And again, I'll see you guys at the end where we do get the results. Okay, so we are done here with the Nord 2, surprisingly faster. But over here with the Mi 11, it's maxed out in terms of the score, but still a very good score indeed over here. Let's check out the temperatures. 
So 39 degrees and let's check out the front over here. It is really, really hot on this phone over here. 40 degrees, not much difference at all as well, 38.6. So as we can see, both of these two phones do have very, very similar performance. The MediaTek Time SD 1200, I would say is quite comparable to the Snapdragon 888. So if you guys did enjoy this video and also want to see more of these type of videos, do click the like and smash the subscribe button down below for more videos like this in the future. Do also follow me on my social as well, on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and also here on YouTube at Dr. Tech. So that is it, this is Dr. Tech. stay safe, take care, and Watch those hands.